Hello. I'm excited to share with you a recipe um, for bread pudding. Basically, I figured out how to make bread pudding after all these years because I liked it a lot when I worked at um, a Greek diner up in New York. But anyway, um, this recipe for bread pudding is not really nutritious. I think the most nutritious thing about it would be the almond milk, which um, has good fat in it and is a good source of calcium. Possibly these egg beaters because they have protein. And of course cinnamon has been said to be good for people for some reason. Um, sugar substitute, not healthy. Um, Sugar-free caramel flavoring, not healthy. And the bread I'm going to use is just um, a low calorie whole wheat, not whole wheat, it's low calorie wheat bread, um, but it's not whole wheat, it's not whole grain. So the main point of this is to have something that is almost a comfort food, but it doesn't put you over your caloric limit for any given day. Um, so, you will also be glad to know that I've made it once before, so I'm not winging it this time. And I'm going to use one cup of Almond Breeze Unsweetened Original. The first time I made it was with the Silk Almond Milk. Vanilla Unsweetened. I don't think it matters though. Um, so a cup of this has 30 calories, but it has two and a half grams of fat and none of it is saturated fat. So if you've been paying attention to the news lately, like the Mediterranean diet, this is the kind of fat you want, the kind found in nuts and olive oil and stuff. So a cup of almond milk, a third of a cup of egg beater, which doesn't have you know, the, the fat from the cholesterol from a regular egg, which they're fine, I would just use one maybe and, and whip it up very well. Um, Mm, how much Splenda did I use? Just about a quarter cup of Splenda and then some cinnamon and caramel, just a drop of the caramel syrup. I haven't taken my bread out because I keep it in the freezer and it's easier to chop it into cubes when it's not soft. So what you do, I can get it out now though I think. Get out your cheap or not cheap bread, just be mindful that if you use regular bread, it'll add more calories. That's not a bad thing if it's a good whole grain bread. Um, just be mindful of how many calories you might need in a given day. But I'm going to use this Nature's Own light wheat. It has 40 calories per slice. I'm using four slices. Four slices of bread for a cup of the milk. <clears throat> and you're going to have to let the bread soak in your milk mixture for 30 minutes and then you'll bake it in the oven. I used an eight inch round tin when I baked mine. Um, so, cup of almond milk. Third of a cup of egg beaters. By the way, a lot of my recipes are showing up in, um, on, script. Someone, uh, Denise actually, someone, someone named Denise, has been writing up my recipes for me, putting them on Google Drive, and I've been uploading them to script, so that's great if you want to go there and check them out. Because I know I go fast sometimes and people want to know what I just did. So, one thing I'm missing is the cinnamon and the Splenda. And you can just put this cinnamon on top when you have it in the bowl that you're going to bake it with. Let's blend up. So I like to whisk things. Whisk that up. Save that for later. And then just like cube your bread. I guess I can do it two at a time. I guess you can make it any size you want. I wonder if I'm still on the camera. I think that I am. I also 
also make my peanut butter and jelly when the bread is still frozen. So, you know, I use that, that awesome Smuckers that you have to keep in the fridge so it's good to have stiff bread to spread it on.
think last time, you know what, I know how many calories from the last time. It was 240 because I split it in half and had 100 calories serving and then I split the other in two and had 260 calorie servings. So there's that. nice and fluffy um, also, which is a good sign. Uh, okay, well that's it. Bread pudding, low calorie, yummy, not so nutritious bread pudding. Maybe even some cocoa powder if you wanted to make it chocolatey. There you can see I might have used too much cinnamon. Sorry you can't smell it. It smells really good. It's the caramel.